Hello everybody. Today I'm going to be showing you how to put crossbars on an enclosed trailer. The reason we put crossbars on our enclosed trailer is because we have a lot of activities that require a lot of gear and most of that gear is large and will not fit in our vehicle or trailer so therefore it ends up on the roof. In our scenario I used Rhino Rack Vortex crossbars and it's using a track bar roof mount. That track bar is meant to go on a beeline sort of track. Instead of doing that, I ran quarter inch Allen head bolts down through the roof into the inside of the enclosed trailer. I use fender washers with a marine grade adhesive like I put on the roof there. It's a caulking that will withstand water and is waterproof as well. So as you can see, these are locks. These are to lock my bikes on. Um, these are Kuat Trios. Kuat makes a great product. I have their Kuat Envy bike rack for the hitch as well. Um, it ratchets around the rear wheel and you uh, put a pin through the front fork and it has a few different options for sizes on that. On the inside here, I'm gonna show you how I bolted the crossbars down. Um, so basically I used quarter inch bolts with a Allen head and ran them down through with fender washers. That's one inch square tubing and that is probably not really that strong. So I'd recommend maybe a couple kayaks, a couple bikes, or just like a rooftop tent, something like that up there. Probably not a whole lot of weight, but other than that, it's waterproof and uh, it works great for our application and uh, we love it. So there it is. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out arnold.escapades at gmail.com and subscribe to see more how-tos and more content from off-grid camping. Thank you all for watching and feel free to give us a follow on social media over at Instagram and subscribe to our YouTube channel.